power cycle and inverter, uh, generally there's two ways to go about doing that. The lengthy way uh, is going to be like this. So your inverter, this is its resting position, the on position when we leave it after install. You can go ahead and turn off the DC here and then reach over to your AC disconnect if you have one and shut that guy off. At that point, both sides of power are off. But technically, you don't need to turn this one off here. You can leave this one on and just go ahead and shut this one off. And that's going to turn off everything for the inverter. Give it a few seconds and then go ahead and turn it right back on. If there's no AC disconnect, though, over the main, <laughs> there will always be a breaker for the inverter. And our breakers are usually up as far away from this main breaker as possible. And they're usually labeled as well. It's going to say inverter output do not relocate. So this is in the on position right here. So if you want to power cycle the inverter without an AC disconnect, you turn that guy off right there. Wait a few seconds, turn it back on. That's it.